So I'm selling my favorite camera. Uh, this is the Fujifilm X100F, and this is without a doubt my favorite camera I've ever had and ever used. The reason it's my favorite is because I can take this thing anywhere, and when you take a camera everywhere, you end up getting some really cool shots. So this video is pretty much like a review, um, kind of just an overlook of the whole camera. I'm actually selling this camera today in like 45 minutes. There's someone coming to pick it up. This camera has been around with me to California, Mexico, um, Nova Scotia, New York, Hawaii a couple times. I think the most important thing that it's ever done is made taking photos of my family so much easier. Just like documenting my mom in the kitchen, um, doing what she likes to do. And um, I think those are really special moments. And I'm so happy I've had this camera to capture those special moments. And it's documented some of the most impactful times of my life and uh, the most important people to me in the most like intimate moments that I have with them. I got the chance to wear this actually all day at my sister's wedding and ended up getting some really nice shots that I think will last um, a lifetime. In terms of like a review for the whole time I've had this camera, I've had this camera for about three years. I got it secondhand off Kijiji um, from a guy near Toronto. And at the time, it wasn't the newest one that was out. I got the one that was a couple years older because I didn't think I needed the newest one that was out. I would give this camera an eight out of 10. And I give it an eight out of 10, not a 10 out of 10, because when I went to blow up all the photos that I took on some trips that I went on, they just didn't turn out the way that I wanted them to. And it's because of the megapixel count and it's because of how big the files are that come out of it. The whole reason why I want to blow up the, the photos that I take on this camera is because I actually like using this camera and I like to take it everywhere. And when I take a camera somewhere, when we go on a trip or we're, you know, it's, it's not a hassle to take it with me. And I think that's the most important thing. This camera taught me that it's not really about the camera. This camera, it takes amazing photos. It has a great color science in it, but it's about the photo that you're taking. It's about what's in front of the camera that matters. One of my favorite things about this is that it turns on very, very fast and can shoot a photo really fast. And I think that's an extremely important for a camera that you wear every day because things happen so quickly and you wanna catch the moment. You don't want someone to you know, redo something that's not genuine. So to catch genuine moments as they're actually happening because you can turn your camera on and off so quickly, um, I think that's a, a super important feature. I think there's something to be said for something that works flawlessly all the time and allows you to capture a moment at a moment's notice. And I haven't really come across a camera that matches up to you know, the abilities of this camera in that way. Obviously the Sony that I'm filming with and the Sony that I use for work, it is really high quality. I love it. It shoots amazing video, 30 frames a second photos, amazing. But it's so big and looks like such a camera that I don't want to take it with me all the time. It makes the best photos, don't get me wrong, but this camera makes the best photos in a different way. So for anybody thinking about getting a camera like this, I highly, highly, highly recommend getting one of these cameras. It doesn't even have to be this cam, it doesn't have to be a Fujifilm camera. It doesn't have to be anything like that. It could just be a old digital camera that your mom used to use. Anything that you can take with you and be in the moment, taking the photo of the moment, that's the point of photography. Because with those type of cameras, you can do what photography is always meant to do and has always meant to do. And that's allow people to be in that moment. Feel the feeling of that photo, how the sun felt on your skin, what it smelled like, the overall you know, feeling of being in that place at that time. That's what it's all about. And I think that's exactly what a point and shoot like this will give you. These are some of my favorite images that have ever come from this camera. Um, right here. Uh, 
When I kiss you, I get a spark. Your body a work of art. Horny thoughts after dark. Used to stay up late to just talk. We was moving fast, trying not to get caught. Damn, your skin so soft. Let me open up your heart. Cause life too short till death do its part. Uh, knew it from the start, you be the one I'm pushing cards with. In the supermarket, you know I love the star shit. Took you to my crib, being Aki and some sawfish. Breakfast in the morning, making waffles and some sausage. Girl, you blow my mind like a Nintendo game cartridge. But when I'm not around, yeah, I think about you often. Sometimes I need my space, cause I don't like the fall shit. Took you on vacation had you swimming with the dolphins living in the barrel now we got our own apartment used to be scared that some poly poly walking like oh shit like, planting flowers in your garden i know y'all told you one day we'll be balling balling yeah other girls they be swarming i'm just trying to make sure that you all in so tell me if you want it